Saturday morning. Thanks, Jeremy. November is National Adoption Month. Instead of featuring a child who needs to be adopted, one of our Wednesday's children, tonight, 13's Lori Hutchinson breaks down some of the myths about adoption. So many folks are drawn to our Wednesday's children, kids in state care who need to be adopted. Yet there are often misperceptions that hold people back. With help from our partners at Foster Adopt Connect, we bust the top myths about adoption, like you have to be married or own your own home to be a forever family. Um, adoptive parents can be married or single. They can own their own home or they can rent their home. Uh, adoptive parents also don't have to be wealthy, have a college degree, have had children before, or be a stay-at-home parent to adopt. Myth number two, adoption is too expensive. A lot of times families feel like they're not able to afford adoption, um, when in reality, adopting out of foster care generally is minimal to no cost at all. Myth number three, older kids don't want to be adopted. You know, as we all know, we never really outgrow the need for a family. Everyone always wants to feel like they belong, no matter how old they are. Myth number four, foster children are bad or dangerous. I think a lot of times teenage kids get a bad rap when entering foster care. A lot of times they've been through a lot of trauma. They're old enough to have seen a lot, remember a lot, and know a lot. Um, and at the end of the day, they're still just kids. You know, they deserve a loving family. They deserve a loving home. And finally, that you have to have everything together to adopt a child. Uh, if this were the case, no one would ever get adopted. Um, you don't have to be perfect to be a perfect parent. If you have room in your home or in your heart, you can help a child in need. With photojournalist Rick Felsberg, Lori Hutchinson, 13 News. You don't have to be perfect. Here's how to get things started. First of all, you can contact Adopt Kansas Kids right there, 855-236-7857, or check out their website, adoptkskids.org, a great resource for you.